Hi Aquarius, getting ready to do your reading? I saw someone cleaning a home before I turned the camera on, so I don't know if they were cleaning like, the cobwebs off of it, getting ready to buy it, sell it, have an open house, maybe it was someone else's home. So I'm not sure exactly what that meant at this point, but I felt like it was a good thing. I also get someone doing a lot of like research right now, researching something, could be a job, could be a place to live, uh, could be you know, a health issue, doing a lot of research is what they said. So what is going on for Aquarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Oh, judgment number 14. It says soul searching will bring inner peace to many areas of your life. That's interesting because it kind of feels like you're listening or learning or researching or getting things cleared up or, okay. So maybe may find something, you know, have a wish fulfilled number 34. I don't know why I said find something. I just kind of feel like doing all this work, researching, cleaning things up is going to help you either uncover something, find something new, something you thought you had lost judgment a wish is coming back around so something could be coming back into your life it could be because of venus retrograde and seeing a lot of that but it doesn't have to be I mean, it could be any wish what is this wish card messages communication moving forward could be traveling and it's a good thing though so eight of wands so i know some people interpret eight of wands differently it can be you know fast movement messages whatever how you interpret it yourself it's what is coming in so you're happy to hear this or find this out. Okay, what is going on for Aquarius? Oh, look at that, the horse, freedom in action. So something is coming in that's gonna cause like a sudden like movement. You can be freed from something. One more, what is this? Heart, new love or love with the heart. Freedom and love, okay. Well, let's see what's going on in your tarot then. I think it's about spicy. I don't know if someone loves spicy food or has been upsetting your stomach lately or something about cutting back on spicy food. What is going on for Aquarius? Okay, we have the Strength card, the Ten of Cups, and the King of Pentacles. So some of you, this could be an Earth sign, maybe, or maybe a Leo, uh, who you do have feelings for. They could be reaching out. I feel like somebody has been away for a while, maybe on, on you know, working and they could be rushing back to you, rushing towards you, Aquarius. Maybe they really missed you. The Knight of Wands. They could be married, by the way, but I would think you would know that. The Eight of Swords. The Tower is in the hidden position, though. This may mean they're not anymore. I'm sorry about that. They may not be married anymore. What is in the outcome? Temperance. So I feel like this person wants you, Aquarius. They want to be with you. They want to see you again and talk to you. But you seem to be getting, giving them kind of a cold shoulder here. Why? What is this um, Eight of Swords energy? Uh, see, I saw the Six of Coins under the deck, actually, when I pulled this thing. I feel like this person is going to bring you gifts or give you gifts or give you something because I feel like they missed you and they maybe they know that you are upset with them. Okay, who is this King of Pentacles? Two of Cups, yep, there's the Six of Coin and all oh, the Three of Swords. So they may know that they have broken your heart or that um, they, it's like they want to make something up. Yep, they want to make something up to you. They have a lot of money, it appears, for the Ten of Pentacles. I feel like in the past they made a bad judgment um, about a situation or they did something they regret now. Like they didn't see it the same way. Like they felt they were being, you know wise or they didn't want to you know spend too much or give you something but they regret that i have a hard exterior okay exterior did i say that right i have a hard exterior what else would they say it says i'm drowning in my emotions no wonder they're rushing back to you and they're very sad they're, they've missed you they feel like they've made some sort of mistake in the past okay we have i kept the wrong company around who interfered with this beautiful connection and we also have my heart is heavy. This person is very sad. It says I never truly moved on. All right. So this is probably Venus retrograde at its greatest coming back towards you. Someone is apologetic. I do feel like they're going to try to make this up to you big time. Gifts, uh, showering you with gifts, taking you out. They may even be getting a divorce. We'll have to clarify this in a minute to see what they're doing. The three of coins, the two of wands, and the seven of cups. I feel like this person is just willing to do whatever it takes. Like, what do you want, Aquarius? So how can I make this up to you? Your wish is my command. You know, like this is like a genie in a bottle. Tell me what you want and I'll give it to you. Show me the tower energy. 
Three of Cups, Magician, Wheel of Fortune, one more, The Sun. So I guess some place they're at is, it's funny, I've been watching a lot of the different tarot readers, and I believe most of them, well, the ones I'm watching are in the States, and it's all been lightning or not thundering there, raining in their backgrounds of the readings, which I love. I don't get a lot of that here in California, but it's just interesting because all of a sudden I got the same thing here, like there's storms, there's rain, there's thunder. Um, I feel like they were somewhere where it was cloudy or dark. They didn't like it there. They're coming home to like you, to the sun, sh the sunshine. Something about that is important. I don't know what that means. Maybe they were like on the west coast or east coast. Actually, that'd be east coast. They want to come back to you on the west coast or something. But manifesting happiness. Now, another way I thought maybe possible also, this person may be getting a divorce or something. They filed the papers. They're getting it going if they are married. But what is this temperance energy and the outcome? Page of coin, three of wands, and the page of swords. Now, page of coin can be them talking to you. If they're an earth sign, it can also be an apology. It's you talking back as the page of swords here. So I do see you being a little bit irritated with this person. One more page of swords. Okay, you want? they're going to apologize. Wow. I just kind of get like, what is it you want? What can I do for you? How can I make this up to you, page of cups? I'll give you whatever you want, Aquarius. Just don't, you know, don't dismiss me. Don't let me go. You know, don't, you know, walk away. How is this person feeling? They must be just heartbroken. So I'm seeing here. It says they have a defense mechanism. So something in the past was their defense mechanism. They put their wall up. Um, but, you know, I feel like it was something you asked for something from the heart. It wasn't a big deal, but they made it a big deal. They were just like, no, you can't have that. Or, no, I'm not seeing you. It was very harsh communication is kind of what I'm getting. Something that you took, like, like it was really hurt your feelings. It wasn't something little or petty. It wasn't like, oh, I can't make it tonight. I'm running late. It was just like maybe multiple times or just it was just very harsh. Um, I felt I felt like they're being, they were very mean. So this there's unspoken truths. They said, um, let me stop. They said, or there are things I wish I had told you, unspoken truths that they never told you. See, I think that these, why can't I talk? Is this, oh my God. I feel like there were a lot of things they didn't tell you and they were kind of cold about the whole situation and they were mean to you. And like, and it's like they felt like you needed a heavy hand in some way, like when it came to communication or lack of communication, they could have even like not told you, like complimented you or they even were mean. So I don't know why they would do that but heart chakra healing oh that's good that usually means they had some sort of awakening some sort of pain themselves that they went through and one more there was a block okay so their heart heart chakra was blocked heart chakra was blocked so okay we're just going to put this to the side i don't know maybe this person has a hard time talking i mean i always kind of have myself but this is pretty bad so maybe they're tripping over their words. It's hard to understand them. Maybe they need to slow down. They're trying to get it out before you turn them down or shut them down type of thing, you know. They want to say everything that they're feeling kind of all at once. They're very excitable, excited. So Aquarius, what are you gonna do? The Four of Swords. But you notice the Knight of Swords is right here on this in this card. It's like this person's rushing towards you. You may already know this, may feel this energy coming towards you. And you're kind of getting ready for what you're going to, you know, say or do. Yep, look at all those Eight of Wands. Look, there's all the messages. It could be on around the 4th of August. Messages from the past. Justice. They are getting to say what they feel, which is kind of nice, I guess. If you're open to it. Um, but I also feel like you also be able to say what you feel. So it goes both ways. It's not just them. So what does this person want you to know, Aquarius? Paradise, happiness, joy, playfulness, enjoying each other, honeymoon phase. I think this also came out in Scorpios. Oh, that's even, that's actually even in the wrong deck, but I guess it's meant to be here. Fluttering heart. Finances. I get like they literally want to give you some money when, you know, pay off your bills whatever you need Aquarius here I'll give it to you thinking of you friends or friendships acquaintance but things are changing they want to be more than friends it's this trust support and loyalty though on there so all right um, that leads me to a different deck actually I want to see something what do they like about you 
because I feel this person is frantic at this point when you see them they may not show it though I think they will but they seem a little bit frantic what does this person like about Aquarius you guys love to stay in together in the near future trustworthy so something's gonna happen in the near future Okay, they, they feel that you're trustworthy that you love music you have something about music that you guys are a perfect match you guys may like to stay in because I got the rain you like may like to play like a video game or a board game or just watch movies or you know eat snacks listen to music something like that so maybe you have something like that in common they love your body they love your curves curvy that you're totally loving Aquarius and you're physically active in some way or another something that you do they like to do it with you so I don't know why I was just curious for some reason I was like well why do they love you so much? I mean I know why but it's like what do they love specifically about you there's something here like they just can't let you go all right well I'm gonna that was a lot that was exhausting this person is exhausting they have a lot of energy then they're just like kind of a uh, all over the place but I'm gonna leave it there Aquarius have a great week you guys